hi guys welcome to or oh, welcome back to exposed and if i'm welcoming you back and you like it here i'd love it if you stayed and subbed comment time jane sex and this city dear god make it stop i wish i could she's on a roll lately miss gracie macy getting things done in feminine energy what in the world is she even babbling on about no clue She's now just making up nonsense just to hear herself talk. There are other people on YouTube doing the same, but what they're saying makes sense. She's just tagging on and she doesn't understand any of it. And she's just babbling, basically. Gracie Macy, Jules, you have the best channel on YouTube and the best followers. I do have the best followers. You are all amazing. Thank you very much. The comments from your followers and you are right on. We're a good team, aren't we? Susan, yes, we're a special bunch of ladies. We are. And men. Don't forget the boys. Loosel man. Loosel man? Boobler. I know. I thought she was going to keep going. I was getting very worried. User ooh. But she has $6 for a Dairy Queen blizzard. Who doesn't know how to put the rod up to hold the hood of a car up? She's so stupid. Apparently her rod's broken. So somebody else, that, does that sound rude, doesn't it? Elysium, why does she seem to think we can't see what we can see what her foundation is doing? She's never close to the camera and she has filters on. Her foundation could be crumbling off in bits and we still wouldn't see anything because of her Vaseline covered lens filter. Exactly. Oh, doesn't this look pretty? What? I can't see anything. Hannah, she's never prepared for a video. Never. Never. Never has been from day one. Hannah, you can put it on 1.25 speed. Oh, right. Yeah, I'd already done it by then, Hannah. Sorry. Oh, and while I've got you here, two seconds, I'm going to show you something. Hold up. Right, I'm back. Because you were saying, don't make your hair purple, blah, 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 blah. I um, went on one of them app things on the iPad the other night just to see how my hair would look at this length purple and I think it looks really pretty what do you think is that not cute I think that's cute honestly it won't be as bad as you think Hannah right where are we Cynthia before I get to the that point where she's rubbing her chest I am on the record as grossed and creeped out at the same time she needs an institution doesn't she though who does that? She should have done that before she came on and just showed it on her hands and arms, but no. Beguile me. I feel like I lose IQ points when she's droning on Snap. It's like, isn't it, Charlie Brown's teacher after a while? It's more, 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 more. I don't hear anything after a while. This is Glenda, Patriot Angel. She's nutters. First time I heard someone from the UK, I laughed and my stomach hurt. I love your commentary you're always right on thank you very much if you haven't seen it already I've got a creative thread all you need to do is if you make and sell things go to this post and it's pinned um, on it's the pinned video on exposed page and go and add a link so that everybody can go and have a look at the things you make and maybe buy some things that's what that's there for if you haven't noticed it Thank you for adding me. I do all sorts of art and commissions and ship worldwide. Any questions, just ask. If you haven't seen, um, you're very welcome, Amanda. If you haven't seen Amanda's dog portraits, you need to go and look now. They're amazing. Bunny Lemon, $25. No way. I know, they're insane. And they say we're jealous. <laughs> no, we're sensible. Cynthia, Lisa wears her hair down all the time because otherwise viewers can see her jowls and ageing skin. The surgery is coming. She asked already for surgery and she was turned down, but she'll keep going till she finds someone who'll take her because that's what she does. If I want something, I just make it happen. I have a feeling she uses the neck tape. Oh, would that get rid of my turkey neck? Would, wouldn't it? I couldn't be asked with that. Can you imagine? I'm to fuck ass around with stuff like that. I think you're right. I think she is as well, girly time. Bonnie, such a fantastic idea. I'll be checking their websites out. Thank you, Bonnie. And if you... 
remind people or or something i don't know what we're going to do like i said i've pinned it as the main thing but no one ever goes to the page so i don't know what else to do but if you make anything and sell things please put your link on there so we can all have a, a look and help each other out lynch why didn't i realize that my feminine energy was a superpower here i am sat not using it to conquer the world's ills i know you and me both nobody told us now we know <laughs> karen what in the world is feminine energy energy is just energy isn't it she really thinks she's so much wisdom to impart but that's the thing there's people talking about it that know what they're talking about and then there's lisa if she's going to preach about she should probably tell us what the fuck it is exactly that's what i said how do i know if i'm sat in my feminine energy if i don't know what my feminine energy is Le vanity lol love that little wide-eyed smiley guy on the screen <laughs> i did that to cover up my thing so she doesn't block me and we won't be able to see anything that's me every time i watch lisa's videos it's me and i'm normally the sleepy one what who did she say something robin spencer what she takes off her next to nothing bralette and panties to weigh herself that's crazy she is that's what she screamed at Brooke. Brooke went away herself one day. And rather than saying, Brooke, you're perfect, get away from the scales, she said, oh, God, Brooke, what are you doing weighing yourself with your clothes on? Raven, we all know her priorities are shopping, self-care, mommy, daddy, then her family. She tries to come off as a woman of the year that knows it all and is per as a perfect phony. She didn't care about anyone. She only cares about her mama because her mama, mama still fucking molly coddles her. That's why. So annoying. Amanda, what is this new obsession with feminine energy? Every video she's banging on about it. I swear she's losing the plot. I wish it had stayed locked. Crack me up. Well, it would have done us all a favour, wouldn't it? How did you manage to watch that? When I looked, I only got the preview. Because after I did it, not long after i did it she realized that it was unlocked and she locked it again or john did because she's stupid who knows <clears throat> peg wow all that stuff she rattled off that she does in a day sounds like a bunch of meaningless shite <laughs> i love how i've got you all saying shite and she had to write them down exactly she's sad isn't she cynthia she's shoving those products out there because she needs that income what a retail haul yep penny she did that to her body on purpose that dark skin is a wound she's never going to get her skin back how it was robin god is she stupid yep we don't even need to do a vote on that zoe don't let her fool you jill she didn't post this to the wrong channel on accident everything is very calculated scheming and dreaming as she said she probably thinks her subscribers will watch this and see what they're missing obviously not much yeah well that's what she was trying to do she's just now convinced everybody they were right not to join she's dumb like a fox lisa marie why is she buying bralettes they are for teens and flat-chested women. They're not designed for women who have paid for bolt-on double Ds. Why does this idiot buy so much useless junk? She needs to stop reading the cosmetics labels to us. She cannot pronounce 95% of the hard words and she sounds like a third grader when she reads. I get the feeling this dummy was always in bonehead math and English classes. That's the thing. Da, 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 da. What's the bit you were saying? Yeah, the bralette. She did that straight after surgery. They told her to wear supportive bra until her wounds had healed, I assume. And she wore bralettes. And now she's wearing bras to bed when it's too fucking late. To I don't know what goes on in her head. And I don't wish to know. Jane, love the comments, videos, Jules. Your community are funny. You all are. All of you are very funny. I love doing the comments. I used to be sat here giggling to myself doing them when I was writing back. Now you get to see, everyone gets to see how funny everybody else is without having to th trawl through a whole page. I think her bank account is hurting. It could be because she seems to be umping the, up in the um, things. Oh, Lord, brain. 
sponsors and all that malarkey. Maria Santiago and other words Lisa called more than half of the YouTubers crybabies, gossipers, whiny lazy, la whiny lazy women. As we all know, lots of YouTubers speak of hard journeys they go through. Hmm. This $25 is a waste of money. She really is a fascist, degrading person. You know how many times she speaks of how losing weight helps you be better at everything. So people that don't look like her are uneducated, bad mothers and wives and don't know how to dress fashionable. God help this woman not to end up in the lake of fire, just saying. I know what you mean. But she thinks she's it and more, doesn't she? Robin, I guess there is really a lot of stupid people out there that follow this idiot. I'm hoping that after the first month they're like, oh hell no. This was a total waste of my money and my time. I'm not doing it again. Christine, the colour of her legs when she models that blue dress and gold shoes is kind of scary. It's awful. I know they look black, black, don't they? Girly Tang, her legs appear to be five times darker than mine. And in years past, I tried several foundation colours that she claimed to use that were too dark for me. No joke in one bit. That's the thing. Which is, if you're my uh, shade sister... Nobody knows what shade you are. You don't know what shade you are. How can anybody be your shade sister? Sha Sha, I'm late to the game. What is she talking about? My assessment is that she's confused about who she is. Sounds like multiple personalities. Oh, it's a whole load of mumbo jumbo about how you make your man masculine if you stay in your feminine energy and all this bollocks new wave nonsense. It's what our grandparents were shaking their heads at our parents about and now we're doing the same. She doesn't know. No, she doesn't know. She's just trying to regurgitate stuff she's heard and she's doing it very badly. Matt, if I had the money like Lisa and it was just, it was just, I'd be all over the world. I'll never get anywhere she goes so we can only dream but still. It's same here, Matt. Me and my husband are never going to get to half the places she goes. So my husband watches walking commuters and stuff like that to get to see the country, which I think is a great way of doing it without having to walk yourself. So you can sit there and pop about. I'm walking with you, <laughs> but you're not. Ja, ja, I love the placement of jewels in this video. It looks like she's a piece of artwork on Lisa's wall above her couch. The most tasteful piece in the whole house. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to have to go and look now. I don't know where I was in the video. And I'm up, up in the corner, but... Bung me in the middle of summer. And people <laughs> are actually paying for this. Shite. <laughs> it does though, doesn't it? Cool. Lisa, you've got me on your wall. You'd be screaming, wouldn't you? Oh, no, I've got to go back down again. Poo. How much further? There we are. And it's done you twice, hasn't it? Weird. Deb, my respect for you soared during one of Lisa's long videos. <laughs> Three minutes left to commentate and tech help crossed your door. You paused the video and asked if he needed you. He said he had a question but didn't realise you were working. You said it didn't matter and asked what it was. Like any young man his age, he asked what's for dinner, lol. By that gesture, you let him and those that were listening know that your family really is your priority. Lisa would never allow that to happen. Oh, thank you, Deb. They are. So I keep saying to them, we have the power of pause. Do you know what I mean? It's like YouTube's going to be there long after I'm gone. So he's more important than any bloody video I'm making. And he makes me like, always oh, asking me what's for dinner. I don't know. <laughs> Susan, oh my God, Lisa would never. Everyone has to make themselves scarce when Queen Lisa is filming. Heaven forbid if anyone has the nerve to interrupt her. That was Jules practicing her feminine energy. <laughs> Is that what it is? Cool. Matt, 
and just like Jules says no one cares unless until it affects happens to them isn't that the truth though Matt no one gives a shit about anything it's like me I've been screaming on Twitter for 12 years about being stuck in this bedroom can anyone help no one gives a shit and then people got long COVID and they're like, oh, I feel like shit. I can't get out of bed. Da, 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 da. And it's like, Zsa, Zsa. oh my goodness. I'm sorry to comment so much, but I can't stand this. Shut up, Lisa. Don't apologize for commenting. I've said before, if you've got something to say, just write it down. I don't care how many times people comment. Run for your lives. The way she says, and I can't with her. I know. So annoying. Serin, ha! None of us want to see her tits. <laughs> I'm telling you, I see an OnlyFans account in her future if her Patreon isn't lucrative enough for her. She obviously seems to enjoy posing in bikinis or her underpants, so OnlyFans wouldn't be that difficult for her. Jar Jar. Everyone needs to say a prayer for Jules. I bow down to you for pushing through. <laughs> it must have been your masculine energy. Yeah. I thought at least at double speed I'd get through it. I feel sorry for those that have got hearing um, machines and things that don't work with the double speed. But I just couldn't do it on normal. And if I was thinking she's going to shut this off in a bit and everyone's going to miss it. So I might as well do it while it was there. Nancy Barrett. Have you tried 1.75 speed? I watch another channel and he goes on that speed and it works great. Everyone since it's in between yeah i've got people that have got hearing adapted hearing things oh words and it doesn't work with them if i speed things up that's the only thing otherwise i would constantly do lisa in double speed because she's just so annoying samantha pears i know she's got no clue mm eat a fucking breadstick lisa your brain is suffering and i'm not kidding we we'll go over there and hold her down and feed her carbs. MM. Anyone remember that pageant girl that answered the question in a word salad such as, that's what she sounds like. Holy, like a little girl playing teacher in front of the mirror. How embarrassing. And charging for it. And people are paying it. And holding the pen. Did you see her? This is me being really important with a pen. And I mark off things on my diary that I had to... Fuck off, would you, Lisa, really? Haven't people been doing that with their timetables in school since time in memoriam? Fucking idiot. Bay, that was insane. Is this part of her Patreon videos that she put up for her stooges? Yep. I'd want a fucking refund. Yes, me too. If I signed up just to listen to the garbage she's selling as personal growth. Frankly, it's laughable. Bimbet teaching other bimbos that should know better by the ripe old age of 50, for fuck's sake. I know. It's like, what are they? What do they think they're going to learn over there? I don't understand. Unless there are young girls there that think she knows. I don't know. I don't get it. Run for your lives. What the fuck is feminine energy? She's truly a fork in a world of soup. <laughs> I like that one. Clown. It's like when Jed says, oh, they're not the sharpest knife in the drawer. And it's like, no, they're a spoon. <laughs> I've never heard that. She's truly a fork in a pot of soup. <laughs> I'm going to have to remember that. Do, do, do. Bay. Wow, her tits are hanging low in that bikini. Those gold shoes are fugly. Gold anything is so gaudy. Re Remery? Re Mary? Aging for Lisa must be terrifying. Her looks are of utmost importance to her. No fruits or vegetables for four years has taken its toll. Exactly. If she'd eat normally, she might have a little more weight on, but she wouldn't look as old. MM. Heel. Heel. I picked up my kids and dropped off and all of her sports practices, etc. It's called adulting. It's not rocket science, Lisa. We all do it, did it have the t-shirt and did more than you to boot i remember her family in the car waiting for her to quit filming so they could leave exactly i remember that as well oh we're going out and um, they're just waiting on me to do this and she said oh i just stop when it's important i stop no you don't 
Oh my God, imagine if her kids had any extracurricular activity, she would have died. That's why they didn't. I know, lol, she really had no clue. I've been a working single mum. Way, way to go, you, MM. And a married stay at home. Maybe I should start a channel. Joking. No, maybe you should. Pardon me. If morons like her are getting $25 a month on Patreon for talking bollocks, there's no reason why you shouldn't start a channel and talk sense. Kelly, yes, we peasants are going to be subjected subjected to all the paid promotional bullshit. Hip hip hooray. Can't wait to watch the little demo. I know, isn't it? We're we're the ones that are gonna get click the links while that lot get all the feminine energy crap. You know she isn't gonna do this promo crap for the dummies. That paid twenty five for her Patreon. At least we can fast forward the hell out of it. Girly Tang. Jules, I thought she was starting her OnlyFans when she was rubbing onto that rubbing on that fancy sponsored oil. Mm hmm Don't we all? Rosalia, Jules, YouTube has cut me off three times to comment. What the hell is wrong with them? Do you know, it's like you can't write anything. What did I write once? I wrote something about fat and it was to do with food. And they were, are you sure you want to make, leave that comment? And it's like, uh, I'm 50 fucking eight. Yeah, I know what I'm saying. Fuck off. I did politically correct on steroids. Love you and all your videos. Keep up the great commenting. You surely make me laugh out loud. Lisa is one sick chick for sure. Thank you very much, Rosalia. I'm sorry YouTube messed you about. Cynthia, of course she had to write down what to say to her offspring. This is the idiot who said she would practice what to say to people who asked, Hi, how are you? And between John's Bitcoin room and Lisa driving to get a Diet Coke every day, guess there's no environmental concerns in their neck of the woods. The entire family's dysfunctional, isn't it though, Cynthia? Her son is 20. I don't get the idea. John even spends that much time with him and they live in the same house. I don't think they spend that much time with him. I think Will's in his room most of the time. Masculine energy. Is she going to link strap-on items next? Oh, we can, but wait and see. That's for when John taps his feminine energy. <laughs> it's all a load of shit, isn't it, really? Rosalia, look at her ratty hair. She should cut it off. She refuses to have short hair no matter how awful and fried it looks. She's brainless. Feminine energy means having positive emotional qualities like empathy and patience, creativity, good communication skills and high self-esteem. Lisa has not a clue what feminine energy is. Love you, Jill. Stay well. You too, Rosalia. Oh my God, people pay for this shit. Why? <laughs> it boggles my mind. Does me, Peg. I don't know. They need help, don't they? Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Oh, I love that name. I'm ah, See, now I've got the song in my head. She's such an American. Takes ages to get to the actual point. Love from Scotland. Thank you. You and Helen should get start chatting and see how near you are to each other. You could, you two could have a meet up. Um, not all Americans. <laughs> she doesn't represent us all. No, but it's it's her. She's got that way of oh and oh, just let me back up. No, don't back. Keep going forward. Just slow enough as it is. Cynthia, bet she doesn't like where she lives now because when she went to the events, people didn't want to be around her. Really, how how would they keep a straight face? They probably hate it when she shows up at the pool. Cannot imagine the conversations that take place in the hood about the ridiculous blonde with the pounds of makeup. I bet you children have asked that. <laughs> Mummy, see that lady over there? Yeah, no, we're not looking at the lady over there. Come o come away, Tristan. <laughs> Take help. When he tells a story, everyone's Timmy. <laughs> Timmy said to his mum. <laughs> Funny. Christine, what a romantic evening. Undivided attention with your husband. Sounds great in theory until she says that they're watching TV. Great family values to pass down to your children. Exactly. That's not undivided attention, is it? 
Peg, right, lol. That's what I thought too. So her and her husband spend quality time together watching TV. Why not channel some masculine energy and take up golf so they have something to do together? And that would get her walking in, wouldn't it? Cynthia, I need that bag that is in the airline seat pocket, Jules. This woman, she needs to stop, just stop. I like the commenter who said to go to Lisa's video and leave soon thereafter to get viewers sent to your site. Brilliant. I'm not sure if it does that, but if he does and you, you don't mind doing that, that'd be great. Where did I read it? Somebody said that, you know, at the end of a video where all different videos end up on the screen, that mine was there at the end of a Lisa video. I bet she was fuming. I need that bag that is in the airline seat pocket. I, Oh, the bath bag. God, that took a while, didn't it? Christine, living within your means is a sacrifice. Lisa, honey, that's just life, not a sacrifice. Kelly, I love a grey t-shirt too. Aren't they great? They seem to wash really well. Much nicer than any other t-shirts. I don't know why. Laughed out loud when you said, of course she got the t-shirts to walk in. They're cropped. Can you believe more shoes? How many feet does she have? Zippy Jean. She spits out exactly the same garbage on her YouTube channel. Those who have paid to watch this have been sucked in left, right and centre. Yeah. We did say it, but they wouldn't listen. 341. It's so important to stay in our feminine energy. John, cook my dinner. <laughs> Let's see. So I, do you know what I mean? It's like I don't need a man to do these things, but I had a man that wanted to do certain things, so I let him do those things and I did the rest. Feminine, masculine energy bollocks. <laughs> Is there ever a clip where I don't swear? <laughs> That's naughty. Poor old John has been completely emasculated. He has to ask permission to walk around his own house because the Queen is filming. I know, it's fucking ridiculous. He needs to make a stand. Delusion of grandeur. Isn't that the truth? MJ Brownlee. I'm convinced Lisa's parents are cousins. <laughs> that has been said before. Peg, could be some truth to that, hence Lisa and Wheels Hasberg jaw. I would have thought more brother and sister. Oh, you lot are bad. <laughs> MM, her switching from masculine to feminine energy. I picture her in a phone booth like Wonder Woman. <laughs> Wonder Woman. <laughs> Can you imagine? That'd be so funny. <laughs> MJ Brownlee, having cat hair all over my house would definitely tell me I've lost my feminine energy. One must always have a beautiful, clean home, Lisa. Yeah, she's clueless. How, how difficult is it to have a lint roller and give the chair a quick run over? No, don't even do that and then just announce that it's the hair chair. MJ Brownlee, oh my God, 1417, somebody invites you to do something and you have to work around the plans. Wow, Lisa is so smart. Why does she think nobody knows this? I know, it's fucking insane. I mark this off Just and I mark have that to off. plan and work all of my work around there. Oh, good God. Somebody help me before I throw this fucking laptop across the room. She's clueless and people are paying for this groundbreaking advice isn't that true she must have looked locked it because i checked on patreon and only 30 seconds of wisdom was available i was going to, over to read the comments you didn't miss much mg brown and jay brownlee they were all ass kissing oh, i love your lipstick oh you look so good today lisa oh this is really helpful more common sense that everyone should have learned in the teen years freaking moron Lisa looks like a freaking stone. She'll blend. I can't wait to hear her stupid observations from the concert. It was loud, y'all, and people were singing along and drinking beer, y'all. 
because I have a feeling John didn't get a luxury box to enjoy the concert from. If he did, I'll be surprised. We'll just have to wait and see. I looked it up to see. I don't know which is nearest to them, though, so I couldn't tell where they'd be going. But they're all really big venues, aren't they? And if, you, if you're not at the front, Mick Jagger's going to look about that big. I'd rather stay at home and watch it on telly. Robin, I so adore you, Jules. Oh, thank you. You're so sweet. Bella. Lisa has her filter turned up so high that you can't even see the hole in her nose. Thanks for going the extra miles, mile, Jules, in putting on those videos of Lisa D1. Yes, it is painful to watch her, but you made it so entertaining that I never miss a single video that you do of her. P.S. Those gold platform shoes look horrific on her. She looks like Donald Duck or Daisy Duck. All feet, nothing else. Ugh. Thank you. Bonnie, well, this was certainly a snooze fest, wasn't it? A lot of people back in the day said they used to put her videos on late at night when they couldn't sleep. Sorry, when they had insomnia and she, they, they'd listen to her for a couple of minutes and doze off. Susan, what is the difference between this video and the video she posts on YouTube? People are paying 25 for this. That's what is in this video that is not in every other video she's ever made. Still, if you're stupid enough to pay $25 a month to get what is already out there on YouTube for free, then you deserve to be taken. Chief's wife, she is the best entertainment. It's so crazy people like this actually exist. She's an older woman on YouTube trying to be 25 and we're here for it all. It's YouTube. She actually believes she looks like a supermodel, like a train wreck you just can't look away from. Lots of people say that about her. Ooh, this is a big one. MJ Brownlee. Lies. I feel like when she says that back when kids were little they could have been more successful if they moved with John's job is rewriting history. They let more money go because they cared about the children staying put. Yeah, right. I don't think they put the kids first for anything. Hence, Wheel's massive face deformity and Brooke's wild ways. They stayed put, like you mentioned, Jules, because of her need to stay close to her parents and because she was probably too scared to start a life elsewhere and maybe John wasn't a prized employee. She's been mentioning this notion lately, trying to rewrite history and look like a good person. Oh, please. She's a sellout for money. If the opportunities were there for more money, she would probably have give up, given up one of the kids. Seriously. It's all a load of bollocks, isn't it? Catcha. Great idea, Jules. I'll definitely check the website when my children go back to school next week. Oh, it's half term, isn't it? That's what it's called here. I don't know. What, what do you call it over there? It's Memorial week or something isn't it i'm hoping we'll get lots of people on there selling things hopefully mj brownlee she likes to pretend she has money but wheels face screams poverty my apologies i don't want to offend anyone but but lisa there's no reason why a rich lady's son needs to walk around with that bite that looks like it hurts the amount she spends in one shopping out of town spree or just on shoes and bags could be deductible for his needs more than enough, really. The only way I could see a kid walking around with that deformity is if the parents have no insurance, perhaps maybe state assistance, but even then he could be on a list and eventually get help. And especially when his big sister is walking around with enormous fake tits. Exactly. And then she'll say something like, oh, Will didn't want to do that. Well, that's when you're a parent and not a best friend and you see the future and you do what's best for your child. Elizabeth, it's very sad about Will. Surgery should have been performed years ago. Poor boy has very little confidence because of his condition. She spent money needlessly instead of helping her son. 1329, John Cooks. What happened to her feminine energy? She was just talking about it. Seems like she just slips in and out of energies, doesn't she, though? I'll be the walk, or if my friends that I enjoy talking with have been boxing me today, or... John Cooks, and then after that, I'll be the walk, or if my friend... John does everything, though, doesn't he? 
There was what was the other thing she said, and I was like, what a load of shite. Oh, I can't remember now. Susan, if her parents had to move every two years, you best believe that Lisa would have thought nothing of uprooting her family to follow Mama and Daddy across the country. Ain't that the truth? They haven't cut the apron strings yet, have they? Melanie, again, I'm insulted and angered at a misconception of masculine and feminine energy. So glad you turned it off when you did. I just, at that point, I was ready to do some damage to my computer. I couldn't listen to her anymore. Bianca, she has billions of lipsticks and glosses and sees Brooke wearing one and she has to have it, just like with everything. The greed. That's what narcs are like. My mother took everything off of me. Anything I bought for myself. Oh, can I borrow that? Melanie. Double speed is slightly less painful. I don't understand what she thinks she's doing differently than every other woman on the world in the world. Can't wait to see her Rolling Stones outfit. I was going to say what she should wear, but I won't because she'll listen to this and do it. <laughs> I cannot stand when she says, one of you sent me this or one of you recommended this. If someone sends you something or recommends a product... And you are thanking them. Take the time to learn their name instead of referring to them as one of you. One of you, these people. Hmm. When she was rubbing, or rather caressing, that cream onto her chest, I thought she'd confused her YouTube channel with OnlyFans. Yep, you and everyone else. Uzia. She's giving rotisserie chicken chest. <laughs> Does look like chicken skin, doesn't it? And salami arms. I try not to comment on looks, but she's doing this to her skin and filtering it out while selling skin products. So, Helen, I love John Wick and did not want to watch it either, but Jamie said you'll love it. He was right. It's fabulous. I think I'm going to have to give in at some point, Helen, because I did bully Jed into watching um, Line of Duty and he eventually watched it. So I need. I think I need to give in at some point and watch John Wick. <laughs> Living within your means. Does she even know what that means? She's clueless. No clue. Even at double speed, she's boring and tedious. Only here for you and the gang, Jules. Thank you, Helen. Can she beat it with the feminine and masculine energy? She has not got a clue when it, what it even means. As you said, Jules, we are just who we are. One person, not two different people. And we can switch between the both. God, she's horrendous. Amanda, sorry, but does she really think her audience is primarily young women who need to be taught Stepford Guide to Child Rearing and Husbandry? Yes, I think that's she's hoping that that's who she's talking to because she doesn't want to be perceived as old, so she thinks she's got a young audience, but she hasn't. Because I think most of them are 40, 50 plus and in their 60s. I'm wondering where she got this feminine energy idea from, but man, she comes out with some crap. How is moaning about men not feminine energy? As you get older, you get more masculine energy. Really? Do you think the shingles vaccine fried her brain as well as her hair? <laughs> Indiana. This channel comes across as bitter, jealous and quite frankly a bit weird. Wow, we've never heard that before, have we? You have... You have you to be a little bit obsessed with Lisa to dedicate time to making such as video. Everything you say is so vile and condescending. Get a life. How is it vile? What have I said that is vile? MM. I'd say anyone coming to Lisa's defence are the ones who are obsessed. Stop. Ha ha, obsessed. I used to watch Lisa about five years ago and just saw a video of hers recently. This lady is clearly invested to be so pissed at everything Lisa says. So negative and vile. In contrast to Lisa who actually comes across as what... See, comes across as. It doesn't mean she is warm, kind and yes, probably over interested in material things. But so what? You all need to get a life. So do you, dear. Elizabeth, Jules, you are not wrong. She's unbearable. What work did she ever do? Sacrifice, like what? Exactly. Hannah, such a meaningful life. I know. We'd never get that. We'd never be as good as her, would we? 
another 100 jobs. Oh, another 100 jewels and you're on 1.5. I'm on 1.5 now. Can you believe it? Whoop, whoop. I'm putting 2,000 out into the cosmos. She has no shame, does she? Rubbing her chest and exposing her boob. I know. And she's supposed... Oh, John doesn't mind. Whatever. Career. Oh, please. Quality time with her kids is talking about clothes. And she's nothing but time on her gnarly hands. So true, Elizabeth. She could spend plenty of time with her kids, but she just doesn't want to. Demera. Regarding her hair, I think what she is calling new growth is actually breakage. That's exactly what it is, but she's too stupid to know. MM. It is. There's no way it fell out and grew back that long that quick. She just lives in, la in a land of delusion, doesn't she, though? Zachary Ferguson, you made my day, Jules. Thank you. Your laugh makes me laugh. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, I'm glad. Glad I gave you a laugh today, Zachary. K pops. People should stop putting their kids on social media. It's a terrible, regrettable thing. I know in years to come we're going to hear all the backlash from it, aren't we? Voyeur. So I have to give Patreon a credit card number even to watch the free content. No way. No, you don't. I'm sure you don't have to do that. If anything pops up as free, I'll have it on here, hopefully. So, But don't be giving them credit card details. Because I heard somewhere, Lardy still getting 30-something dollars a month from her Patreon. And she hasn't done anything on it for two years. And somebody said, for them to cancel their whatever they're paying a month, she has to okay it. So if she's not answering Patreon emails, they're stuck paying her till the end of time. That's wrong. Mama Sita, tempted by the fruit of another. Oh, that's it. It's in my head now. I've got a suitcase. I have seen Squeeze so many times, and I was so lucky they played at my uncle's club. So I got to see them for free loads of times as well. Tempted by a car. <laughs> Love you, Jules. Thank you, Mama Sita. Penny Pierce. Sounds like she's starving the cats. Truly repulsed by her. I don't know what's going on with her cats, but it's weird. Gen X Granny. Can someone please tell this woman there's such a thing as two tan? My gosh, she looks ridiculous. Overbaked. No moisturisers will be able to fix, o fix overexposure. Peg. Let's all meet in Ireland and have a party. That'd be cool. I can't afford to go to the corner shop at the moment, though. <laughs> Would you really come over to Ireland, Elizabeth? Ah, oh, we'll have to have a virtual part I Irish party or something. If we ever get to 2,000. Yes, Jules, 1.5. Thank you, Hannah. I was thinking this afternoon, wouldn't it be great if it was 1.5 tonight? And yes, I was so happy when i looked on and it was there it was like yay slowly but surely we're getting up that mountain bonnie i think people are finally realizing jules has been right from the beginning she's such an amazing person oh stop i won't get out the door my head will be too big boys graham you could send your dedicated subs cheap souvenirs like magnets or cheap costume jewelry or gift cards that a dedicated sub gave you like glenda merle did is that what she did how is that thanking her subscribers by giving them stuff that her subscri- Nox. Steph, 2000 is in striking distance. Great job. I'm so happy for you. Thank you, honey. Deb, as hard as she works, she deserves that and more. Oh, thank you. Barbara, if she really... Is she really going to the pool with all that crap on her face? Yes. I can't imagine what she looks like once the heat starts melting it. She has a full face of makeup and a big hat. And she sits there. Oh, look at me. Earth, moon and stars. I was wondering if you were going to do this one. The Marnie one. Somebody sent me. I'm, I'm saying somebody because I don't want to out people when they write to me. But um, a lady wrote to me and said... You should see the difference between this and Lisa's video. And then I thought, hang on, I won't watch it. I'll react to it. I did used to watch Barney back in the day, occasionally. 
when she had her dog Bosley because I loved Bosley and I used to check in to see how he was doing but apart from the fact that she's married and has two boys I don't really know much about her but her video was great fun I thoroughly enjoyed it Baddy One Shoe what a terrific idea how wonderful I hope a lot more people stick their, their links on there Meet Virginia always the panda eyes when she needs something clever that isn't it Trisha that's exactly what I was hoping you would do after watching Marnie's video. I know she is friends with Lisa, but they couldn't be more different. Actually, I'm surprised they are even friends, as Marnie used to be a school teacher and knows proper grammar. Thing is, though, YouTube can connect people, can't it? And especially because Marnie and Lisa and that, they started around the same time. So they would have made friends back then. And it's like they don't actually have to see each other that often. It's like once a year maybe. So it's easy to keep that sort of a friendship going, isn't it? Without having to do too much, if you know what I mean. Bonnie, lol, how dare anyone disagree with the almighty Laurie Beth? I know, wasn't she fuming in that? Summer sh <laughs> Summers McHugh. Love you, Jules. Thank you, Summers. Painted monolid. Oh my god. I'd never know that's Miss Girl Girl. Why? Have I missed something? Meet Virginia. Sarah Jane. I adore her. She actually donates 70% of her clothes that she shows off on her videos. I don't know why she talks to a narcissistic Lisa. It's a YouTube thing, isn't it? It's like I just said about Marnie. I think it's just they're polite to each other and Lisa calls everyone her friend. Susan, Marnie is so sweet and down to earth compared to Lisa. And easy to listen to. Samantha Ferrari. She lost a ton of weight. Ozempic or the dreaded carnivore? Has she? See, I think she was that size when I watched her back in the Bosley days so did she get bigger in between and now she's smaller again I don't know Trisha she has lost weight I'm not sure what she did but it wasn't carnivore I believe it was Ozempic that's scary that stuff people need to read into it more yes Marnie has lost a ton of weight I'm guessing Ozempic oh well that's why you didn't know it was Marnie Marnie will probably say she adjusted her thyroid meds See, I didn't know she needed weight to lose, but she looks fine to me. Linda, and who had an ivory wrap on? Oh, Brooke. Have to love those hillbilly dumpkins. Congrats, Jules. Your channel is growing quite nicely. Thank you. It, slowly but surely, we're getting there. Sandpiper Lane. I don't know how to pronounce this now. Chi Huli. Chi Huli? At the Biltmore, large-scale glasses sculptures. Quite the pleasant deviation from mundane Lisa. I actually looked him up. Is it here? Yeah, I was looking at this one. Look at that. It's amazing, isn't it? I've got... When we went on a, a family holiday, when Tech Help was little, we went to Blackpool, and I got a glass-blown um, Blackpool Tower. It's on the windowsill and a kitchen it's all different colors it's really pretty <laughs> my sister-in-law visited and she went oh i didn't know you'd been to paris and it's like no it's not the eiffel tower it's blackpool <laughs> i have been to paris though but i didn't get a, a bl glass blown tower samantha dumb as a box of hair Rebecca, Marnie is on the same level as Lisa, but in a different way. Cannot stand her either. Narcissistic, selfish, link whore, boastful, worst dresser, codependent wife, liar, dirty looking house, depressing decor. I could go on and on. She's irritating. Oh, don't, don't hold back now. Say what you really think. I just found her video so refreshing after so much of Lisa's umming and ahhing and oh I'll put it down there oh I don't know it was just nice to hear someone that could form a sentence for a change Chihuly a fantastic glass artist isn't he though I've been looking at his stuff it's amazing Tammy Jules was the candy you were asking about for Halloween candy corn yes that's it 
Fucking triangles of sugar. Woo! How do you eat that stuff? I was like, oh, it looks cute. And everyone talks about candy corn. Their favourite thing about Halloween. I'll get some from Amazon. And I was like, where's the water? Quick. My teeth are falling out. End to Wabbit. I bet they knew Asheville was a big out. I bet if they knew Asheville was a big town, a big outlet town, they would have all been shopping. It would made me laugh the amount of times Lisa said, "Oh, it wasn't a shopping trip." It's like, what even is that? It wasn't a shopping holiday. Del Chihuly is blind in one eye, and his work is amazing. I've been looking. Let's go, Brandon, and it is. It's very good. I love the I love colourful stuff like that. Big guy on me. I think she might have been a little bit perturbed. I think she might have been. Someone pissed her off for sure. Bo re cure. I'm sure that's wrong. Such a different experience from what we saw from D one's video. So well done. But where's a shot of a hallway? I know. It's not good enough, Marnie. You should have taken a picture of the hall. Jane, the most obvious comparison includes a brain. Wasn't it just a breath of fresh air to listen to someone do a whole video without backing up, writing it somewhere or not knowing something? Karen Brown, Marnie is a lovely grounded person, very relatable. She has lost a ton of weight, but good for her. Matt. Is that who does give a fuck that we got blocked, Lardas? Who cares exactly? Nobody cares, Matt. She used to threaten that all the time. I'll block you. Go on then. Do we care? No. Nikos, what cracked me up about this video is she actually thought that she was that significant and important enough to be nasty like that to her subs, even to her subs that were dumb enough to pay to support her Patreon. No one cared if they got blocked. She's all flap and no propeller. I love your sayings. You're so funny. Bonnie, great video. Medical insurance has gone downhill. They pay what they want to and you're responsible for the rest. We pay a ridiculous amount each month and still have a lot out of pocket costs. It's wrong. I'm sorry. If you pay insurance, right, if you pay car insurance and you have a car crash, do you have to pay some of the money towards them compensating whoever you've crashed with or whatever? No. When you buy insurance, that should cover things. Or at least the basics. Do you know what I mean? Like GP um, appointments and emergencies and things like that. But if you want to have something extra above and beyond done, you have to pay towards it. But um, It's scary. Catcher, food of the devil. What a <laughs> table full of carbs. Imagine. Not had carbs for so long and you go and there's a table full of carbs. You'd be like a toddler on fucking sugar, wouldn't you? Whizzing round the room. Karen, I believe she said it was a carry-on bag. Oh, that thing with the thing. I must have missed her saying that then. If it was carry-on, that's great. Because I was just worried she was putting that... And in, in, in it's like, no, don't put all your precious things in that and then give it to them idiots to throw across. Nikki Venable. Whoa, that last bit was wild. She was pissed. The hippopotamus was riled up, wasn't she? LPH. I don't follow her or watch her videos, but she's pretty and seems pretty level-headed. MJ Brownlee. Meh. Watch her long enough, she comes off as snarky and snobby. But yes, for a long time I thought she was different than other YouTubers, but they're all the same. It's quite sad really, isn't it? Maybe at the end of the day, these so-called influencers are all out there to make money. I don't take fashion advice or life lessons from them. There are many professional and intelligent women on social media who I get inspiration and learn something. Rake's Funny Farm. 
Lisa was only there to plug her channel and show one of these dresses. Exactly. She couldn't be bothered to spend some time showing Brooke around the place. Her ideal of fun is shopping. Marnie did a great job showing more to this place. Thanks for doing this video. That's the thing. Now people might want to visit it. If they just went on what Lisa said, no one would bother. MJ Brownlee. I also believe she was there so Brooke could make friends with other YouTubers and get Brooke a leg up in the influencer business. Thing is, though, Brooke isn't interested. She had a channel. She was gifted thousands and she never bothered to keep it going. So I don't think she wants to do the work. Maya Lightseeker. I find it sad that Lisa could have done all those fun things with Brooke, but all she cares about is pics of their outfits in the bathroom, the hallway and going to bed early. I know, it is sad, isn't it? MJ Brownlee. Another big difference was the husband was present, not otherwise engaged somewhere else. Just saying speaks volumes. So true. I agree, but I can see where some husbands wouldn't want to go to a YouTuber's wedding. But if I were there with my grown daughter, I would have definitely visited those places that Marnie did. Robin, the first travel case she was talking about was also a carry-on. I'm sorry, I missed it. I'm stupid. Jane, pure mania, wasn't it? I've never seen her that bad. That's an unusual avatar. Cute Opiax. This is my first time watching any videos on this channel. It just popped up on first impressions. Jill seems like a jealous bully. <sighs> Cat Mama. I can't see how these two can be friends. Marnie is quite intelligent. Whereas Lisa, I don't think she can count past 20 if she didn't have her fingers and toes. I think it's a showman's type thing, isn't it? It's all for YouTube. Cersei Claffen. Me remembering me remembering nearly all the bags from the Jag collection in Kisslock's other apartment on the diamond tray. I think I watched that video like 40 times. Purse collection gold. Lisa's got purse collection goals or somebody else. I don't know what Kisslux is. Why do you want them, Cersei? Just asking. I'd rather pay good money for something that wasn't advertising somebody. And some of the really, really expensive bags are fugly. I don't understand. Karen, I cannot understand the friendship between Marnie and Lisa. You're not alone by the sounds of it. Jamie, that was a great video. I enjoyed it. I really, it was nice. Nice change listening to Marnie instead of Lisa. Gaz... Gaznat the moon. Never cared for either. Both snobs in my opinion. I don't need anybody telling me how I should celebrate Memorial Day and what it means. They both play and use the playbook template at how to manipulate people. Lisa thinks a lizard is going to kill her and Marnie thinks a black bear, it as she refers to it, is going to attack her. Both are idiots to me. Robin Spencer. Marnie is a sweet, educated, lovely lady. I see I have split opinion here, haven't I? Her video highlighted the beautiful grounds, interesting side trips, and spoke of the beautiful bride and the wonderful wedding. She's a class act. Lisa couldn't be more different. Sharon. I can't believe she went on a trip, saw the sights, ate the food and didn't come home with £20,000 of designer handbags. What was she thinking? She was stuck in the middle of nowhere and they didn't have any apparently. Or they didn't. She didn't know they did. Tammy, last my, laughing my ass off. I totally enjoyed her losing her shit. I don't know. She thinks she's somebody though, doesn't she? If you've given me money, if you've done this, oh go fuck yourself. Melissa, this was enlightening. I wonder how friendly Marnie and Lisa really are exactly. Jules, it was great to see you enjoy a video. <laughs> Thank you. But it was, wasn't it? A refreshing change. Marnie used to shade her back in the day, so she used to also shade anyone getting paid by links, etc. But now you can't ask her where she got a pencil without it being linked. You get no answer, just the link. She's also done 
the bottom of the barrel sponsorships for a payday all kinds of shit on that family oh well I hope people don't think I'm like that Carol thanks for showing us this Jules I don't watch Marnie she annoyed and bored me too much she's changed quite a bit much more intelligent review of the weekend than the other yeah it was just nice to see a different view of the same weekend wasn't it I agree. Why are they leaving the reception so early? It's not like they can do it again next week. Very rude, in my opinion, not to celebrate along with the new couple. Exactly. At least get up for a couple of dances. Carol. Oops, did Lisa miss a high-end shop? I don't remember her mentioning it. Just that they had to run out and get tape and a shawl. Uh. She missed it. Bonnie Lemon. And this is what a vacation video should be. Enjoying history, scenery and food. What a pleasure to watch. I'd forgotten all about her. I remember she had a huge dog. Yeah, Bosley. I loved Bosley. And I think she had a line of purses. Thank you for sharing. Yeah, I used to watch her on and off back in the day to see what Bosley was up to. And I haven't watched her in years. But that was a nice video. I enjoyed it. Bonnie, I think we should take up a thank you collection for jewels would enjoy having a live with you to celebrate right i'll do a live then because i can't get to ireland <laughs> as much as i would love to mama sita marnie is such a charming and knowledgeable delight an absolute breath of fresh air particularly after watching the narco idiot thanks jules love you thank you mama sita no way i watched her from the beginning she's none of those things lol for a one-off video though no 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 <laughs> marnie is pathetic and greedy too oh my god no just for the one video mm it was it was nice to have a change of pace marnie doesn't do anything without seeing how she can make dollar signs off it they are cheap tacky and fake as fuck she's vile oh dear and yes she put the memorial thing in because she was called out for linking sales after sale after sale in the name of memorial day i see see that's the thing when you don't know it's like with uh glenda and that when you don't know the background i mean marnie doesn't have the front page thread on the gossip bakery for nothing do you know what i mean there has to be a reason for it but all i'm saying is i enjoyed that video to actually see the scenery and hear about the wedding without the oh and oh and she looks so pretty for a change so i'm gonna have to put the fan on for a bit i'm cooking what can i put you so it's not so loud that's all right and it but then you can't hear me put you a little bit that way Katya, exactly jules parents want better for their children she only thinks about herself keeping both of her children in the wilmington bubble i know that's all we want is for them to do what they want to do and i was all set for mine to i don't know join a circus run away with a circus <laughs> do you know what i mean <laughs> be a hippy dippy thing out in the fields whatever they wanted to do because i'd been told i couldn't do anything i wanted to do neither of them want to do that obviously but i still go with whatever their choice is their choice do you know what i mean they're they're their own people and i'm here to support them kelly refreshing not to hear that marnie left dinner early because she didn't want to hear anyone say anything about her only eating meat and being on the carnivore diet which is probably bullshit anyway because no one gives a hoot about what lisa eats exactly never seen a marnie video but she seems really down to earth and way less worried about what everyone thinks go girl thanks jill thank you kelly apparently not it was just a a quick um what's the word i'm looking for diversion just for once i won't be doing it again because she's not popular apparently julie that is glass art we have a chihuly museum here in st petersburg florida is that where he's from do you notice how detailed marnie is compared to lisa when lisa tried to describe the hotel she went off topic and compared the hotel to animals and dogs burying fucking ginger snaps Lisa said, you know how dogs do dog things and cats do cat things and then told us the hotel was authentically itself just like the animals. And I, I still, to this day, do not know 
what the frig she was trying to say makes no sense at all kelly i just went over to her patreon and watched a preview and she was giggling herself silly talking about her cats a social eater ooh, social eaters and laughing about these people and how she cannot believe how these people got upset over her patreon so we are these people and we don't know how she thinks about us but we can imagine and that laugh is her just laughing her butt off about folks that are really hurt and feel she doesn't give a fuck about her loyal followers yeah i've she's pissed a lot of people off kelly but she'll still just sit there laughing raking the money in and not care bay marnie and her husband are actually educated people i like marnie's style she dresses for her age and is not like some tawdry hooker in sequins and gold gold shoes like our pal lisa d1 i'm not marking the thing in me bobs oops kelly you mean making a list checking it twice lisa thinks that's neurosurgery she says stinker instead of brat exactly exactly lisa marie how do i you cannot compare marnie to lisa marnie has a master's degree and she worked as a reading specialist for a very short time before her boys were born marnie's husband was also in the military and served as a jag lawyer Lisa is an uneducated, dumb hill hillbilly. I used to watch Marnie years ago and stopped because she became very abrasive and she left very rude comments to viewers on her YouTube channel. It's really very simple. Marnie is not a moron. Lisa is a moron. You cannot compare apples to oranges. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, is that it? Are we done? Right, let's see. If anyone's been put on the naughty step. No. Whoop, whoop right i don't uh, it's a good job actually hang on, let me turn this off for a minute because I, I can put it back on in a sec can't i when i'm finished ha ah, thank you everybody for all your comments and if you got to the end of me thank you very much and i hope to see you in the next one